divas, it's here. A uh, sneak peek of how I do my hair. Like I said, highly requested video. So if you guys really wanna see a sneak peek of how I apply weave or pieces to my hair, please do yourself a favor and continue to watch. Till next time, divas. Hey divas, so I am in the bathroom looking crazy and I'm in the process of doing my hair. I was supposed to record this video for you guys, but I got extremely lazy and it was time constricted because it's getting really close to nine o'clock and yeah, I gotta watch my scandal. But I decided to give you guys a, I guess a mini sneak peek of how I do my hair it's always always highly requested but what I'm doing with my hair now is I'm putting pieces in it and um as you see this right here is my real hair well, let me move over so the light isn't that bad this right here is my real hair and then there goes the track so this is what I do when I want my hair to appear longer you know thicker all that good stuff it's really 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 easy um, the only thing that I do, of course, is flat iron my hair after it's been, you know, washed and I've been under the dryer. And I add the glue that you get from the, um, your local beauty supply store. And I add it to the her. Of course, you know, before I put it on, I measure it, you know, measure it to fit the part and then I cut it. And then I place the glue on and there you have it. And this is eight inch hair. I had already started trimming it, you know, little by little because there was no need for me to give a 10 inch because I really didn't want my hair to be that long. But yeah, here's a little sneak peek of um, how I put in tracks in my hair. Really simple, easy, it's just a little time consuming. I hate doing my hair myself. I prefer to go to a stylist but you know things happen but yeah divas sneak peek i will end up doing a full tutorial soon of course my this part of my hair has already been curled i don't know if you can see but yeah I curl the back first before i get to this oh and one more tip I guess I can let you on. When you're doing this, do not put any grease or any product on your hair. It has to be just dry because the glue, if any grease or anything's on your hair, the grease is the glue's enemy and it will not allow the glue to stick to your hair as it's supposed to. But yes, Divas, sneak peek. Let me hurry up, finish doing my hair before scandal comes on. So, yeah, I'm looking all crazy. <laughs> okay, so i um, done the hard part. <laughs> I have basically already curled the short parts of my hair and I'm finished applying the, um, the tracks. I even trimmed them and all I have to do now is curl them, but I just wanted y'all to see the finished, um, the finished, the finished look, I guess. Well, not really, because my hair is not curled. Okay, so, oops. Here is the track, and there is my real hair. You always leave a little bit to cover up the track, and you flat iron it to blend it in. Also, another, um, another trick is to, when you're applying the glue, do not apply it all the way to, you know, your forehead. You always leave a little bit of hair out to you know disguise each track because you kind of want this to look as natural as possible so you see when i twist it to the side you really can't see any of the the tracks because i have little pieces of hair out to cover up the track but yeah oh my god i need to take a break <laughs> this is crazy yeah now it's time for me to curl this and then I will be good to go but yeah I love tracks when they're first put in because it's just so fresh and well blended 
I am in the curling phases right now. Um, now that I, it's getting curled and I can see the definition of the curls, I'll probably end up um, trimming some more off, at least layering it, like maybe like trim this top half a little bit, just a little bit. So that way it'll have a more layered effect, like long on the bottom, short on the top, and then you'll be able to see it with the loose curls. Um, of course, you can curl your hair however you want, loose or tight. I prefer loose. I don't know, I just like how it's looking. It's a style that I've been rocking for the past uh, couple, of, couple of weeks. So, yeah, let me go ahead and hurry up and finish. And I'll be back with the, uh, the finished product. Okay, Davis? Okay, so last night I totally forgot to record the finished hair. I got caught up in watching Scandal and then one thing led to another and I completely forgot to finish recording to let y'all see the the finished hair. But here is the finished hair. You see I um I trimmed it a little bit you know to get it the desired length that I wanted it to be. But yes this is the finished hair. Also um like I said this is just a sneak peek of how I um, apply pieces weave to my hair. And if you have any comments that you, not comments, any questions that you may have about how I do my hair or my hair in general, just please leave them down below and I will answer them when I do the full hair tutorial. So that way, you know, everybody gets their questions answered because this is like a highly, 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 highly requested video everyone's always asking about my hair and what products do I use and how do I style it and all of the above it's just like they borderline care more about my hair than the makeup <laughs> but yeah anyways leave your comments down below so I can answer them in the full tutorial on my hair whenever I do it whenever I do the tutorial but yeah never mind rambling on appreciate you guys Taking the time out to, you know, watch this little quick snippet of how I do my hair. Yeah, anyways, thanks so much, Divas. Till the next video.